What's up guys, welcome to Enzyme Hoops, the number one source for basketball players with connections to the state of Utah. This past weekend there was a lot of games and a lot of impressive performances, let's get right into it. First up, let's head over to France where former BYU guard Charles Abuo plays for Le Portel. On Sunday, Abuo led his team in scoring, finishing with 17 points, 4 rebounds, and 3 assists in 32 minutes. He was 6 of 10 from the field, 1 of 3 from 3, and 4 of 4 from the free throw line in a tough loss. Abuo has consistently been one of Leportel's best scorers, and it is not uncommon to find his name near the top of the box score. Heading back over to the United States, former BYU basketball forward Yoli Childs had his best game with the Salt Lake City Stars on Saturday against the Rio Grande Valley Vipers. Childs stuffed the stat sheet, finishing with 12 points, 11 rebounds, 3 assists, 3 steals, and 3 blocks in 29 minutes. He was 6 of 8 from the field and 0 of 2 from the free throw line, despite a blowout loss. Games like this are classic Yoli games. He was dominant around the basket, crashed the boards, and got himself a double-double, and he made his presence felt on the defensive side of the floor by using his long arms and athleticism. This is the kind of play that's going to get him a shot in the NBA. And finally, former University of Utah center Jakob Pertl played one of his best games of the season on Sunday. Against Joel Embiid and the Philadelphia 76ers, Pertl had 25 points, 10 rebounds, 4 blocks, and 2 assists in 39 minutes. He was 11 of 16 from the field and 3 of 4 from the free throw line as the Spurs lost a tough one, 115 to 109. All right, that's going to do it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more videos like this. If there's any players that you would like an update on, then make sure to leave them down in the comment section below and I'll let you guys know how they're doing. People were asking about Jimmer in my last video. There will be an update on him pretty soon. It's hard to give an exact timeline, but my guess would be sometime around the beginning of February, we should be hearing an update on Jimmer. All right, I'll see you guys in the next video.